guys, welcome to today's match day vlog with myself, the Peaky Pundit for Full Time Devils. We are on the right way to Carrow Road as United travel to Norwich. United looking to get back to winning ways in the Premier League after that defeat away to Newcastle. But the good news is we did have a win away from home against Partizan in the week with a 1-0 win. Um, let's see if Brandon Williams gets his opportunity to start today. Man of the match in the week with a fantastic performance in the Europa League. Uh, loads of exciting uh, content coming for you in this vlog, so stay tuned. We've got special access all areas from the press box. Let's go. Yes, guys, we're here at Carrow Road, nice and early. We're all set up. Um, just going to be heading over to the press box shortly. Access all areas, loads of content, as I said, coming for you guys today. We're going to be pitch side in the dugout. We're going to be in the press room. Uh, all of that coming your way. Uh, and if you're lucky, you might just see me feature on Sky Sports a little later today. Right guys, as you can see, I am here in the press room and this is the very seat where Ole Gunnar Solskjaer and Daniel Farker will be sitting after the game for their post-match press conferences where they'll face the world's media. Um, we've been floating around, we've been mingling a little bit. I've got a bit of a good vibe today. Uh, I think we're going to get a good result. I can feel the positive energy in the air uh, and I'm looking forward to some exciting things we've got coming for you guys today. Yes, guys, as you can see, we are here pitch side yet again at another United away day. Uh, the pitch is looking in absolutely mint condition. We see the sprinklers are on, uh, getting the pitch ready for kickoff. Uh, we're still about three hours away from kickoff. We've still got loads of content to put together before then. Uh, we're going to be sat just up here in the press box for today's game. So that's where the world's media is going to be there. We're situated up there. Great view of the whole pitch up there. Um, looking forward to uh, seeing you guys a bit later on. Okay, so this is one of the flash interview areas where the managers and players will be gripped up by the media straight after the game uh, to get in here to tackle any questions relating to the game. Uh, and this is where you might see managers run. You might see players being congratulated. Let's hope it is one of the United players today uh, for a solid performance and win. So the official match ball is in place, ready for today's kickoff at 4.30. Uh, we're here in the tunnel. Let's go check it out. Right guys, so this is the players' tunnel where both teams are going to be coming out from at around half past four, uh, straight out, straight onto the pitch as well. Quite a narrow tunnel, um, I can see. Uh, obviously the players will be straight out of here, straight onto the pitch, about half past four, four kickoff. So I'm sat here in the away team's dugout. Ole Gunnar Solskjaer and his backroom staff and the substitutes will be sat here uh, for today's game. Um, it'll be interesting to see will Brandon Williams start after his impressive Man of the Match performance in the week. We'll be bringing you that when the team news is dropped in about an hour's time. It's a press box uh, food say, mate. Strong six, I'll give it a strong six. Yeah? Better not than, bad, United, better than United hot dog? Chips are nice and crispy, I'll give them that. I think they've been blanched. And a hot dog, something yet to tuck into it. Starting 11, Team News has dropped. Oli has reverted back to a 4-2-3-1 formation. Uh, Young comes in for Brandon Williams, as expected, even though we had a great game away, two parts and Belgrade. Front three of Rashford, James and Martial should be interesting. Let's hope United get all three points. Guys, as you can see from behind me, both teams have been out warming up. United are looking sharp, a bit of a change. The Reds are making their way into the stadium, as you can see over on the far side there. The atmosphere's building up. We're about 15 minutes from kickoff. Let's go, United. Minute of the game takes a little bit of the shine off, but still 3 1 United. 
So again, it's finished United 3 1. Winners, Pav, what do you reckon? You know what? Two bits penalty, should have scored a lot more. But look, positive shots on target, outplayed them. I'm happy with today's performance. Definitely, look, fair enough, conceded the goal. It takes a little shine off, but equally created a lot. And goals, 3 1, take it all day long. It's a policing thing. It's a, it's a difficult place to come to, but when we're uh, as focused and concentrated and on the front foot as we were today, we can beat anyone away from home. Right guys, so that is a wrap. We are just heading back home now after an action-packed day featuring on Sky Sports, seeing loads of goals, two penalty misses, but nevertheless, three points for United on the road. Uh, good performance from Oli and the team. Good team selection, everyone to a man played fantastically well. So everyone is happy as United pick up three points away from home in the league for the first time in a very long time. Uh, we'll be catching you guys on the next day, match day vlog, so stay tuned.